When employees report to work at some brand new buildings on Amazon's Seattle campus next week, managers might be tempted to say, welcome to the jungle. Jamie Yukas got a sneak peek. It's called the spheres, three in all, reaching 90 feet high. Amazon isn't just reshaping the Seattle skyline. They're also reinventing the idea of office space. It's a place where all employees in the company can come and hang out and get in touch with nature. An Amazon rainforest in cold, rainy downtown Seattle. The company asked horticulturist Ron Gagliardo to make it happen. When Amazon said, we want you to have free reign and pick whatever you want and... Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> One of the things I've kind of learned here has been you can't be afraid to think big. This 62-foot wall is the centerpiece of Amazon Spheres. It's made up of 25,000 plants, 200 species from 30 countries. That includes a 55-foot fig tree named Ruby that could only be brought in by crane and a temporary hole in the roof. There are streams, fish, chocolate plants, vanilla orchids all designed for employees with high-stress jobs to disconnect. Do you want people to feel like they're in a treehouse? Yeah, yeah, we want people to, to walk on this, so this is bouncy. And, and go, oh, wait a minute, it's moving, I better put my phone down. Amazon pumped $4 billion into this campus, designed both for visitors and its rapidly growing Seattle base, now 40,000 workers. One of the complaints you hear is that Amazon came in and then the prices of everything went through the roof. A lot of jobs have been created well beyond the Amazon jobs, all the construction jobs that have gone into building this area. And build they have. Watch out, Space Needle. There's a new landmark in town. Jamie Yukis, CBS News, Seattle.